You guys know what this video is about. I'm going to be discussing Im Sama and Jewelry Bonnie's relationship along with the Gorosei. And I think it's quite simple, honestly. I think that Jewelry Bonnie's relationship with the Gorosei and Im Sama has to do with their devil fruit. We've seen the world government in pursuit of four things in total. The first one is power. This is why this is where you get more people joining the world government. This is where you get the multinational organization, the strongest organization in history, yada yada yada, so on and so forth. The second thing is to cover up what happened in the void century and uh, with the will of D. Anything relating to either of these two, erase it. The third thing is a eugenics purge of massive proportion to specific bloodlines. This is where you get the whole thing where if Ace was found out as a kid, he would have been executed, Ace being executed later, that sort of thing. And finally, an obsession with immortality. Now, the obsession with immortality, we see two examples of it. The first one is the Ope Ope no Mi, which we see in the Do Flamengo flashback, the world government really wanted their hands on the Ope Ope no Mi and were willing to pay an obscene amount of money for it. Now, the second thing is Jewelry Bonnie. Now, with Jewelry Bonnie, we know that her devil fruit could prolong someone's life because it could make someone younger. It's not a permanent case of youth in the same way that the Ope Ope no Mi is. But it's a more long-term thing where you could take Jewelry Bonnie. She would stay with you alive for however long she'd need to be alive. Keep your guys young until you got the Ope Ope no Mi enough times that you would uh, make the Gorosei immortal and also make Im Sama immortal. And then you wouldn't need uh, the Jewelry Bonnie Devil Fruit Holder anymore. Probably ex dispose of her because she'd know too much about the secrets that the Gorosei and Im Sama have. And I'm guessing this is also why she was captured by a Kainu, is because she is important. Kainu couldn't kill her because they need her to keep some of the Gorosei alive until they get the uh, Ope Ope no Mi enough times so they could all be immortal. And this is hinted at when uh, this is hinted at when a Kainu says specifically, "When you escaped from the world government, that sh that sent." shivers down my spine when you escape the world government escape the world government not escaped impel down she did not get the crocodile treatment she did not get the dofi treatment she did not get the buggy treatment she got the nico robin treatment she went straight to any's lobby and probably to mary joe's afterwards this is the thing when something like this happens it immediately has ties to the gorosei and imsa immediately it has to either do with the void century or something they want or the celestial dragons it's one of those things that's it that's it i'm guessing what happened between kuma and bonnie was that bonnie managed to escape a while ago probably back when tiger fisher tiger was introduced and created havoc in the Holy Kingdom. Maybe that was her opportune time to dip. And she managed to dip. But then uh, she met Kuma, and Kuma took care of her, so on and so forth. And then you had the whole Shapil with Kuma joining the Shichibu Kai, uh, Kuma, becoming a rev sorry, Kuma becoming a revolutionary, then jo joining the Shichibu Kai. And then she was like, nah, I'm not having any of this, you raised me. I'm a pursue you, and that's where that went. In my perspective, that is the conclusion I reached, and I'm not sure if I'm the first one that reached it. Probably others have before me. But this is what I have to offer. Um, now, the evidence I have for saying that she was used to prolong the Gorosei's life is in Nico Robin's flashback. We find out that Nico Robin's flashback. We find out that one of the Gor we sorry we don't see one of the Gorosei's faces. One of the Gor Gorosei's, the blonde Gorosei. You could watch this as many times as you want. We don't see him. He's always shaded every single time we watch. We go. We watch it through. We we see him shaded in, 
And I'm guessing the reason we see him shaded in is because the world government didn't have their hands on jewelry Bonnie at the time. So what ended up happening is he was still an old geezer. He still didn't get the jewelry Bonnie treatment. He was still he, he wasn't uh, he he didn't you know he wasn't as uh, young looking as he is now, and he looks pretty young compared to the rest of the Gorosei. Just saying, this guy probably looked like a geezer when the Nico Robin flashback happened, and revealing him at this time would show that something is off, and they're playing with their age. And then Jewelry Bonnie, that, that would be the obvious hint. Now, other hints having to do with the world government aren't many, they're just, how should I say this? It's just that in terms of her bounty being too high, it's like little things like her bounty, that are the hints. Blackbeard said, I can't believe someone as weak as you has a bounty of over 100 mil. Again, people with, oh, with overly high bounties have those overly high bounties for a reason. Either their bloodline in the case of Ace, that big straw hat in the case of Luffy, or Bonnie's ability and the demand for her ability. And I guarantee you, we did not officially see Bonnie's wanted poster for a reason as well. Because I guarantee you, Bonnie's wanted poster has only a live on it, just like Sanji's. Guaranteed. She's wanted only a live, and I'm guessing that's why Blackbeard didn't kill her. Because if you think about it, Blackbeard could have easily killed Bonnie. He could have easily killed Bonnie, and what ended up, that what would happen is they'd still want her because, so to verify that she's dead, so to speak, and he would just get the money. And the boat. But Blackbeard didn't kill her, and I'm guessing Blackbeard didn't kill her because her poster says wanted alive. And she was she's wanted alive for a reason, and that is the reason I'm guessing, is because she could make people younger. Now, if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like. Please tell me what you guys think of this video down in the comment threads below. And until next time, guys, this is Anime Gypsy, and I'm out. See you guys later. Bye.